From the city, the hinterland, and the surrounding bogs, it's the new EN Eyewitness News with your co-anchors Donna Pleasance and Joan Manners. Thank you for choosing the new EN Eyewitness News. Now here's Joan with our first story. Thank you, Donna. No, thank you, Joan. No, thank you. <laughs> President Bush made a surprise visit to Iraq on U.S. Thanksgiving Day to show his support for American troops. It's hard to tell which one is the turkey. <laughs> Donna? Thank you, Joan. No, thank you, Donna. No, thank you. <laughs> An Air Canada employee was caught smuggling $4 million worth of cocaine on board one of their flights. A spokesman for the financially troubled airline condemned the act, then later announced plans for a brand new regional carrier, Air Snort. <laughs> Joan? Thank you, Donna. My pleasure. No, mine. Thank you. No, thank me. Mm. <laughs> the Discovery Channel broadcast a live solar eclipse from Antarctica in high-definition television. HDTV is said to be ten times clearer than normal television. We have footage of the solar eclipse. <laughs> wow. And a special thank you to the people at Discovery for sharing that film. Thank you, Discovery. Yes, thank you. And thank you, Joan, for saying that. Well, thank you for thanking me, Donna. No, thank you. Oh, thank you. In other news, engineers in Tokyo have unveiled a walking robot called WL-16. Canadian engineers are unimpressed, saying we already have one of those. It's called Stephen Harper. <laughs> And now here's Donna with the next story. Thank you, Joan. No, thank you, Donna. Thank you. <laughs> Turkish Prime Minister Recep Tayyip Erdogan has condemned the actions of Kedek terrorists who have been linked to Harakat Ul Mujahideen, Al Qaeda, and a splinter group of the Abu Sayyaf group. Political analyst Joseph Chirinchoni of the Bahudan Priel Foundation pointed out Kanhi extremists in their negotiations with Bulgarian Ambassador Valentin Puryasov failed to take into consideration Namibia leader Nujoma's concerns that by intervention by Georgian acting president Nino Birdsey-Nadze, whose allegiance with Ivorian president Laurent Bobgo and his counterpart from Burkina Faso Agyakum Kufor could cause Shintaki rebels to separate from Dev Sol, which might lead to confusion in the area. Joan? Thank you for that story, Donna. Thank you for putting it in my pile, Joan. <laughs> also, thank you. In the news, country pop star Faith Hill has re-recorded one of her old songs and given it a Christmas flavor. Following suit are the Rolling Stones, who have released Jumpin' Santa Flash. <laughs> Madonna released I Saw Mommy Lesbian Kissing Mrs. Santa Claus. <laughs> and rapper Snoop Dogg released Jingle Ho Rock and the Twelve Lays of Christmas. <laughs> Donna. Thank you, Joan. Vortman Cookies have announced they are eliminating trans fats from their products, thus turning their back on the lucrative fat slob market. <laughs> For those who are unfamiliar, trans fats are like ordinary fats, but they like to dress up in women's clothing. <laughs> And that's it for the new ENI Witness News. Thank you for watching, and thank you, Donna. Well, thank you, Joan. No, oh, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you for leaving. 